everybody and welcome back to another video. I can't even control roll my excitement. I'ma go too fast. I don't care about those limits. Cause I want this to last like nothing ever lasts before. As per usual, I'm very excited today. I have traveled extremely far not too far but it's been like a two hour train journey and it cost me 50 pounds to get to my destination today which is a bit ridiculous but you gotta do what you gotta do don't you so i'm in a place called folkstone could be butchering that i'm probably butchering that name but i'm gonna call it folkstone i literally only just got off the train and we're heading down to like the harbor and i'm on the hunt to find a secret beach but basically, I have no idea what this place is like. It's nice, I'm out of the city, and we're gonna go on an adventure today because believe it or not, it is 31 degrees, <laughs> which is crazy for England. So I'm very excited. It's a heat wave. I love a heat wave. I love the heat. So we're really just gonna go and make the most of today, aren't we? And I'm so excited. Hopefully it's a good time. It should be because the sun's out, so it's always a good time. Anyway. I hope you all enjoy. Thank you for clicking on the video and watching. It's basically it. Let's let's get this adventure started. Get the show on the road. Let's go. From what I've gathered, which isn't a whole lot, I'm assuming this is a real like kind of beachy town. Like obviously it is a beachy town because I'm right next to the coastline. But I'm telling you, when I got off the train, there at least like a hundred other people getting off as well with me so everyone's got the same idea when it's hot um but yeah so i'm hoping fingers crossed it's a cool place because there's heaps of people around you can't tell right now but there are so i've got high hopes it's gonna be a good day okay so i found a road of remembrance it's lovely look at this look at all the poppies they've made oh my god the ocean oh don't get me started i can't I can't even tell you every time every single time I find it it just hits me in a spot it's so nice I genuinely feel like I'm back in my hometown Wollongong right now because that literally I'm not kidding you the walkway and then going down onto the beach oh guys we haven't even started yet and it's going to be really hard for me not to <laughs> go down there and get in the water because I want to go to like a more secluded private beach. Oh my God, but it's so nice. I can't hold myself, I have to go down there. Um, oh my God, guys, yes! This place looks wicked. I can't tell if it's pebbles or sand. Fingers crossed it's sand. Let's go find out, I'm so excited. I'ma go too fast. Just stop talking to me. You know when you've like set your maps to lead you somewhere and then you just get distracted, end up somewhere else, and they're still talking in your ear, and you're like, shut up. Not right now, I'm onto something here. Look at me just getting hyped over nature again. <laughs> I can't even control my excitement. What is wrong with me? I love it, you know. I absolutely love it. Oh my God, I miss it so much. When I, I sound so dramatic right now, but when I'm away from the beach for a long period of time, I tell ya, I do miss it and I get so excited every single time I come back. Ah, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna regroup and then we'll, we'll get back to each other, okay? That's gotta be my favorite thing when on one side you've got mountains and cliffs and then on the other side you've got the ocean. Well, we found a giant bell. I got really excited when I found it because I thought that it was one of those massive jumpy swings and I was like, oh, I'm gonna be the first person on there. But it's just a bell that I don't think works anymore. First little pit stop. The water looks insane it looks so nice and i don't know if you'll be able to see on the camera but there's people over there boys jumping off into the water which i tell you what i could get amongst it does look like fun but <laughs> you're gonna like walk down and be like hey 
I'm gonna jump into. I need some water. It's a water break. Because I'm thirsty. Oh my god, while we're at it as well, you're not gonna believe these overnight oats I attempted to make. They turned out disgusting. So, imagine I tried to make some oats yesterday. Oh my god i'm not even joking i don't know if you'll be able to see but it is it's like a soup i've created a soup and they were meant to be overnight oats anyway i'm getting distracted what was i doing oh yeah we need to fill up our water and then continue our journey to wherever i'm going i'd swim here but i like i said i want to find a private beach it's really hot though, so I doubt any beach is going to be private today. I drank like nothing my whole way here because I knew I was going to be like stranded somewhere needing a pee. Alright, we are going to continue. Oh my god. You know what? I've done it. I found the coolest place. Look. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, it's so peaceful here. It's so nice, I'm telling you. I think one of the beaches I want to attempt to get to are literally over there. You'll see where the cliffs are. Like right, <laughs> right over there. I'm assuming there'll be like a bit where I can sort of sneak down and see <laughs> what's going on. These cute little places. Oh my god. It's so, so cute. It's so nice and exciting to see things finally starting to open up again and like the liveliness of places is coming back oh i love it i love it oh wow that beach over there is jam-packed they got a couple of these crazy staircases look it just like this one's blocked off but it literally just goes down <laughs> into the water they have another one back there but it, it wasn't blocked off at all so you can just literally walk down look this is where we are I need to travel more. I'm so glad that I'm doing this. I've set myself a goal to get out of my comfort zone more and go to more places. I don't understand why people just want to spend their days at home. I don't get it. I don't like it. Once a week, yeah, love it. But I would much rather be out here exploring new places. Oh my. destination we're gonna go over there we're gonna walk all up these cliffs and then we're gonna go and attempt to find a private beach of some sort this little thing is pretty cool oh my god they've got a couple so they got this one the little orange one but then they've got a little pink one over here i just noticed in the middle of the water right over there Ooh, wonder what they're for what time is it? I can't miss my train back because I'm screwed if I do, so I can't miss my train back. Still got a few hours, so I'm gonna go and try and find like a more secluded beach now. And then we're gonna get in because it wouldn't be one of my videos if I'm not getting in the water, is it? So this is so pretty. Make it undone, my heart is breaking. What can I do? What can I say? Fucking, oh, people are partying, man. There's so many people here. This is hilarious. I can't believe how many people are here. This is so funny. Guys, I'm sure that you just saw that, but that was crazy back there. It's like a mini festival on the beach. I'm way too shy to like go and just be by myself amongst all of that. But no, it was cool to walk through. It's such a cool vibe. Everyone's out having um, a great time. So it's really cool. I need a drink break. So thirsty. We're in a very different um, environment now. It's more, <laughs> would you say desert-like? Believe it or not, I don't know if you, yeah, see the very tip of there. That's where the lighthouse was. So we've walked quite far. Look, I love being amongst the party and being where everybody is, but I also love being out of it and just 
where it's more peaceful. Hence why we're on the hunt for a more secluded beach. Oh, there's a pathway there. That could lead to like a little beach. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna keep going. Oh my God. I'm going down guys. That's gonna be nice. Swimming over there with the white cliffs. That's a whole vibe in itself. I will meet you guys at the beach. Imagine, right? Imagine all the nice beaches I've been to today and I end up at fucking this. And it smells, <laughs> but nonetheless, we love her. We have arrived at our destination. I'm not walking any further. Not quite where I wanted to be. I'm so confused. My phone is glitching out. I don't know if it's 145 or 245 because it keeps changing. Weird. So I was really confused about what time it is because basically I can't miss my train that's at 350. So my plan is to leave here at three to start walking back just so I have enough time. Um, and I just checked my phone and it's saying that it's like almost three o'clock. It's like 2.55 and I was like, that's not right. That can't be right. I'm sure it's only 1.55. And I was so confused. And then I went into my world clocks on my phone and I realized that I'm in a different time zone right now, which is bizarre. Like imagine walking so far that you're in a different time zone. What are the chances? <laughs> so I'm gonna pretend that I'm in London time right now and that's what I'm gonna go off basically because I don't wanna have to leave yet. I haven't even got in the water yet. So yeah, I'm gonna pretend it's an hour earlier than it actually is. That's my plan. It's that time. I'm gonna go in. Is it cold? Is it cold? I don't like the rocks. Why do they have to have massive boulders everywhere? All right, I'm not gonna focus on what I don't like. I'm gonna focus on what I do like. Oh my God, guys. No, it is sand. Oh my God, I have sand under my feet in the water. What the fuck? Oh no, there's a rock. Ready? I like it here because I can stand. <laughs> I reckon we've walked about like 15 k's today. <laughs> Gone beach hopping and we finally made it in the water and this is just unreal. For anyone who wants to find a good beach place in England, Folkestone. I like it here a lot man. But it's so nice it's really and it's cool because i you had the option to either go into a really lively place or somewhere like this where it's more low-key secluded probably not as nice of a beach but i mean look at that view can't complain can you and on that note i think i'm gonna go ahead and conclude the video so wish me luck on getting home because i'm gonna act like i'm an hour behind so if i miss my train i'm fucked um, but all in all, 50 pounds for a train ticket today, it was worth it. Okay, I'll see you all in the next video. I hope you enjoyed, thank you for watching, like it, subscribe if you want to, and yeah, I'll see you all later. Have a good day, bye! You're special and you're reckless, and babe, you're my bestest friend, yeah, she's my bestie, my love for you is endless. Nobody else can end it